Now, Unit 3, Electrochemistry, Reaction. Reaction means change in state. There are two types of reactions. First, physical reaction. Physical reaction means change in physical state. Chemical reaction means change in chemical state. Well, one of the chemical reaction is acid-base reaction. In acid-base reaction, acid react with base to give salt and water. To find out whether it is acid-base reaction or not, you have to find out oxidation number of elements. Oxidation number of hydrogen is plus 1, chlorine minus 1. In NaOH, sodium plus 1, oxygen minus 2, hydrogen plus 1. In NaCl, sodium plus 1, chlorine minus 1. In H2, hydrogen plus 1, oxygen minus 2. So here you can see there is no change in oxidation number of any element. So if there is no change in oxidation number of any element, then it is acid-base reaction. Because in redox reaction there is always change in oxidation number. So normally in acid-base reaction, no exchange of electron takes place. And therefore, oxidation number of each element remains constant. So this is the characteristic of acid-base reaction. Next chemical reaction is redox reaction. If you take zinc and copper sulfate solution, then zinc sulfate and copper is produced. So keep zinc plate in copper sulfate solution. This reaction may be possible. Oxidation number of zinc, oxidation number of zinc is 0. Valency of SO4 is minus 2. Therefore, copper is plus 2. SO4 on the right hand side is minus 2, therefore zinc plus 2 and copper 0. So here you can see oxidation number of zinc changes from 0 to plus 2 and oxidation number of copper changes from plus 2 to 0. So there is change in oxidation number and therefore one of the element is oxidized another element is reduced. Oxidation means electrons are released. So here zinc is oxidized and therefore we will get zinc plus 2 and 2 electrons. During oxidation, oxidation number of element increases. So 0, 2 plus 2 is oxidation. Reduction. When electrons are added, it is called reduction. And here copper plus 2 is reduced to copper. Oxidation number of copper on the left hand side is plus 2, right side 0. So when oxidation number decreases, it is known as reduction. So here zinc release electron, copper gain electrons. So there will be electron transfer during redox reaction. And transfer of electron is known as current. That means if you carry redox reaction, it is possible to produce current. So chemical energy can be converted to electrical energy. And electric current is the most important source of energy for us. So we can produce electricity with the help of redox reaction. This is the most beautiful application of chemistry. And the device which produces current with the help of Redox reaction is known as electrochemical cell.